Thanks for the view. Sigma, like and subscribe. Sigviver, Sigvival, Sigscriber. All day. Minecraft, need to be, need to be, need to be, need to be. Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Feed the Beast featuring Sigma. Today is episode number 19. It's actually nighttime in Minecraft. But today, we are going to quarry. I've set it up to make sure everything works, and I'll show you how I did that right here. So, as you can see, I've got another ender tank. Uh, I put a brown um, uh, color on there so that it's a different. Um, a different pool of lava that's going to fuel our geothermal generator and that is enough to power these three guys now what we got here is it's called do I, where is it it is ba -ba -da -ba, redstone energy conduit and this is actually really cool it was kind of fun to make so you need um, molten redstone and a liquid transposer along with a con uh, energy conduit which is hardened glass and electrium which to get hardened glass to get electrium yada 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 and all that stuff so we got those set up there so now basically what's gonna happen is these guys I could have just hooked this machine straight up onto these little thing but this way these guys are gonna pump that energy into this quarry and it's gonna continuously drill down there and this should this should last I don't think this should be able to go all the way down to bedrock and I won't run out of power ideally so this is what how it looks underneath here so I set it all up so that I could flip a switch and they'll turn on and I use that same redstone alloy wire and this is wood so it'll conduct um, and I've got the wire also coming up to the back here so that just because I like these lights red means off, green means on. Red means stop, green means go. So, we've got that. Now, I need to set up some transport pipes to filter out all these items. And I've got labels too so that I can label it um, as well. And let's do that. This, this is going to be the lengthy process and that's why I set it up beforehand because I wanted to make sure that uh, that this was all good ready to go because setting it up uh, this up took quite a bit of time even just building here I'll show you this little uh, sh shack that I built for it even this took quite a bit of time um, I don't know why I used <laughs> the cobble I should probably change that to wood but for now we're leaving that as it is and using these little the the micro blocks l just made these cool little window frames and I think that looks really cool I like the contrast with the brown and the purple and the, with the nether brick and so on and so forth. Just take a minute and bask in it real quick. And oddly enough, I, I wanted to set this up so that it was super close to where our, our, our sewage is pumping down so that I can, when it starts to get deeper, I can tear that open and then that will uh, block off the lava so that it can continually pump. So, now let's set this up. This is going to be the most time consuming and complex part of this. So, actually, I think I want, I want diamond there. Um, do I have a, a stone? Perfect. Okay. So I have, I'm using cobblestone and stone. These cobblestone and stone won't connect together. So I could put them next to each other and they won't connect. The only way that these two pipes will connect is if you use a sandstone one, which is neither here nor there. For the, but for this, for these purposes, I'm using these because I can put one up and one down, and now these two guys won't go. And I could have this guy jetting off this way, and I could have this one coming off this way, and those pipes will not cross, pa cross paths. Now they'll. I don't even think they'll connect together. See? Look at that no connector. They said, do you want to connect? And I'm like, no sorry Bob. Have a nice day. So, what should we put first? Um, let's see. Actually, you know what? Let's do this. So I have an ender chest here. And let's punch this out of the way. And I'll show you where this one's set up to go 
after this. So color code it brown, white, brown, white. That's my Cori combination. So now we need to go into the setup here and oh, let's put a pipe. We've got our uh, cobblestone pipe here. So, oh, hey, 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 hey. So under the blue setting, this is all the stuff that we're going to turn and we're going to recycle. We're basically going to recycle all the dirt, try to recycle all the dirt and all the cobblestone. Now this is going to eventually get backed up because there's no way that this chest is going to be able to support as much stuff as coming through. So maybe we'll just do the, the cobblestone for right now. And we'll send the dirt somewhere else because this might be too intense um, and I might have to fix that because this is going to be a lot of stuff. So coming on the other side through the red Come on, man. So going through the red side now, we'll have a chest. And let's put for the red, I'm going to put a, ooh, actually, I'm going to do that first. Do I have the ink on me? Yes. Crafting bench. So this was the other thing I was going to show you guys on camera before just making it. We're going to make a void pipe. And now what this does, the void transport pipe, what happens is garbage that we don't want goes away. It just dissolves. So it, it's, it's a better way of just letting it just hit the ground. So let's put the marble that way, because I don't want marble. I don't, I don't need marble. I got plenty of marble. If I need some more, there's tons of it all over the place. So we have those filters applied for our first one. So now we got void pipe. Actually, I don't even need that right there. I can take that off. Oh, where'd he go? Where'd he go? Let's get that back. So, so void pipes are good for it's for garbage. If there's something you don't want, there'll be a, a bunch of other stuff that we want to put there. But for right now, we're just going to put that. Um, so now everything that's oh, oh come on, I am so bad at that right now nothing in my hand. So anything that's not marble or cobblestone will be able to pass through the white gate and go on to our next filter. And I don't, let's see if, if uh, this shouldn't connect. Oh, no, but it does. We don't want that to connect. So that's a dead. That's a dead end. We want the dead end stuff going that way. All right. So now what we could do is connect these pipes like so and now when we want filters we could basically put the chests underneath and they'll filter those out and I could even have chef them coming this way and one off this way if I want if I so choose which I do so choose so let's put him like so and this is gonna be a complete mess so bear with me on that, guys and gals. Okay, perfect. So let's set some chests down, apply some more filters, and get the show on the road. Okay, so what what else do we need a filter on? Um, what do we want to send the, through the yellow pipe? Uh, let's do gems. So let's put him up there. Let's put him up there. I don't have any rubies yet. Let's put the amber through there. Um, let's go ahead and put the lapis and the redstone. And I don't have any nickelite on me right now. But I would also put nickelite through there. Okay. So, and then this yellow pipe, let's put the coal. So coal will be coming up this way and dropping into this chest right here. And I'll organize this out a little bit better. I'm just using this this is a demonstration. Just to demonstrate the awesomeness of these pipes. So he's dead end. We don't want anything connecting there. Now if I had a sandstone pipe, I could sandstone pipe 
these two together if I wanted a, uh, something else. So what what else is there that we can apply a filter for? Oh, I keep doing that. Um, let's see, let's see. So we've got we've got our our, our lapis, our redstone. Um, so all of our ores and stuff like that. Once we have some, the ores are basically should be going up and coming through this blue one. So let's close him off for now and put him right here. Oh, there we go. That's what we can put on there. Um, I'm going to do one for flint and gravel as well. Let's do flint and gravel. So, do I have any flint and gravel on me? I have gravel. Filter. Done. I don't have flint, I don't think. Nope. Okay, that's okay. So for now, we'll wait until we get some stuff. And let's let's power this bad boy on and, and, and see how she goes. Uh we also need to put that gravel. Is that black? Yeah, let's put that on black. Cause we want the we want the coal to keep going through. And I could put this on the filter here. It doesn't matter. Um but now, now he, he's going to go, and he's sucking up dirt. So all we're going to get is dirt for now. And which way is dirt going? Dirt's going into this chest. This is the anything goes chest. So let's see what we got. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Yellow is the only thing. So yeah, that means dirt's going to be coming over here. So we might want to put a filter on for dirt, because... There's going to be a lot of dirt. So let's filter this way. And let's do stone so that they don't connect. And a chest. And these are gold chests. So dirt on black. Now I don't, it should start pumping stuff out, but I don't see anything coming through here. But it's working. I can see it going. Oh, come on, buddy. Maybe it can't because there's a uh, diamond pipe there. Maybe I can't have a, a diamond pipe. Let me check, and we'll see. Be right. All right, so I took it all off, and we're just testing to see what's going on here. Because for some reason, it's not pumping anything out, which is not what we want. Hmm. It's funny because it was shooting stuff out like mad. Is it all going into this ender chest? Maybe that's what's going on. Yep. It's all going in the ender chest. <laughs> of course. Okay. Where's my pick? I gotta move that. I gotta reapply the filters. Okay. So. And let me fix this and we'll be right back. Turn. Okay. There we go. So it's set up a little better so that now it's it's all going over into those chests. So let's see, are there any other filters that we want to put on here for now? I don't think so. D dirt needs a place to go. Um, oh, whoops. Oh, you up there. Dirt's the one that needs its own entity because it's going to be a lot. Let's put the dirt in the black filter on this diamond pipe. Okay. Now we should be cooking. Let's fire them up. Make sure everything's chingon. So now we should see some dirt coming through there. If not, I'm gonna, there we go. Perfect. We got some sand and we got some dirt. Dirt should be the thing we see the most of. Um coming through there and it, it'll probably be like this for quite a while speaking of which I'm going to shut my door because of my luck some creepers are going to come and blow up now this should be high enough where they can't get in um, I made it so that they can't uh, get in here speaking of creepers there's a creeper right there speak oh the devil if it ain't the beaver himself 
I tried to put a lot of light up so that I didn't have to deal with all those bad guys like that, but they didn't want to play that way. They said, screw that mess. We do what we want. Let's see how this is going. Look at it go. It's just chugging along. It doesn't look like it's breaking those blocks. But it definitely is. Look at all this dirt. I might have to make a void pipe of dirt very, very soon. Um, you see, as you can see, so the filter allows it to go through all those and comes over here into this chest like so. Actually, I might, I might turn, I might just recycle the dirt. Let's recycle the dirt. Not for now. Let's just leave it over there because that's a lot of dirt. Because I know you could turn cobblestone into, la into lava. Um, so this is a cool, a cool way that you can also buy. Um, <laughs> you could buy. You could get netherrack if and you go set up a quarry, or you could set up a mining, a mining um, thing. IC2 has a mining thing similar to this. I like, oh, it's just a chunk of air. I like this thing. It just, it kind of looks cooler. And it's like super high tech. But the, the pump is definitely easier. Does this guy think he can get in here? I don't want him blowing up my quarry setup. Ooh, doggy. Stay out of here, beaver. So did I put, oh, yes. So this is the other thing I did. I put some bronze electron tubes in here, which are amazing for the efficiency of these machines. It adds a little bit more percent of, um, very, it's very, very marginal, but, you know, every little bit helps with this situation. Um, I'm going to just dump all this other stuff, like this ore and all this junk in here for now. Because I don't want that all on my person. The void pipes, that stuff. The helmet can stay. Let's take that back. That definitely back. Um, and I can even help speed this thing along right now with some free power that I have. That could stay. Is there anything in here that I absolutely need? I'm going to leave all the ore in here for now. Let's apply. Let's see this. Let's just look. Oh, it's, it's not too, too much. Let's, I'm going to put these little signs on like so. Let's take a dirt. And shift right click. Now I know that that's dirt. That's pretty much all we're getting right now is dirt. So I'm going to help the process out. I'm going to go outside the home. I'm pretty much going to end up draining my uh, my laser right here, but it's okay. Oh, 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 oh. So you can kind of see what's going to be underneath there. There's a bunch of those stupid crystals. I want to get a couple of those. I'll put those in the void pipe too because homie do not play that. All right, so we're going to hit our mode, right click will change that um, mode. So let's get rid of some of this. Let's help this guy speed up a little bit. Get rid of some of this dirt. So that the ooh. Guess I was in that blast radius. Dang. Also doing this causes um, causes a lot of block lag because the chunks don't stay like there and stuff. But this thing will scoop it up. Um, yeah, boom. Ooh, there's some copper. The other thing that you could do to help it out is actually come down here and just mine. If you want to be here while, it, while it's going, by all means, you can. But this thing will stay loaded and all that kind of stuff on its own. Now let me let me show you the other thing I've set up here in this whole process of doing this is I'm also okay. We can leave the dirt in there for now. Um, I I definitely want to keep the sand because that's glass. These these might actually be these chests might be too big. Um, I don't know, but that's a lot of dirt, and eventually that'll all be cobblestone, and that's why I put it into this pipe. 
and I'll show you why. Let me label. Ooh, can I put a label on that? Oh, that's so awesome! That is cool. I didn't realize you could put them on ender chests. We're just going like that. Boom. Because that's all that's there. Straight cobblestone, baby. Yeah. Okay, what's this filter? That's coal. This one's straight up dirt. There's nothing else in there. Okay. So, close that. So, this chest. You're like, wonder, wonder what is he, why is the cobble going in there? Let me show you why. This is just what I'm doing. Um, I'm sure there are plenty of other people that do the same thing. Look at that, I drained 6% of my juice from blasting. Uh, blasting that guy real quick with my, uh, or blasting that thing up. Oh, oh, oh. Explosive gun mining laser. There we go. I'm thinking about too many things at one time. Um, I'm going to move all my uh, uh, thermal expansion machines over here. And I'm going to set up like a, a magma crucible thingy like I have for the IC2 stuff. Because then I'm just going to leave all the IC2 and the Greg Tech stuff over in this area. So, here's the other ender, t ender chest. This is where all that dirt and going to be cobblestone is coming. So let's power him on. And now he is going to extract the... It will be cobble, but right now it's dirt. It's going to extract that dirt, and then it's going to recycle that and get a bunch of scrap, because we need the scrap to make you, you matter. Because that's the next big project. Now that we have... Now that we have that done, that's our next big project, is getting a matter fabricator. Because once we have the matter fabricator, then we can start fabricating some matter. See, there we go, we got some scrap. Actually, that's, that's not bad. It's some, some free energy. I think it takes like 60 or 85, 65 or 45 EU to chop one of these guys up, but you don't always get scrap. So it's just a good way to um, get rid of some of those things. I'm going to actually put some overclockers in here. This is actually a really fast process, but I'm going to have so much stuff, I'm not going to know what to do with it. So then now also, I set up another pump to extract those little guys into this chest because. I don't know how how long this is going to take or what it, it's all going to do, but it's going to be the point where it's pretty ridiculous. Let's see how much faster it is with this overclocker. Oh, well, it's pretty quick. Let's see how much two does. Two two's pretty good. We'll put three in there. Yeah, look at that. Three three eats it up like like a hot knife through butter. Okay, so the Cory is finally. Finally, finally done. I promised, and it's done now. So let's update. Let's update our project tree. Um, so I need to do the logger, still, and solar panels. This is episode 18. Actually, it would be cool is to put my my plans on my notebook um, up, up updated what's today today is June 14th episode 19 all right so So number one, solar panels. Number two, matter fabricate. Call it, just call it M MFAB for short. We know what that means. Three, logger. Four, uh, tree. Uh, I don't even know what it's called. Fertilization or uh, tree breeding? It's called tree breeding. 
Okay, solar panel solar panels equal free energy. Um matter fabricator for iridium. I don't know if that's how you spell it. Logger just because tree breeding I like trees. I like trees. You know what? I'm not gonna say like tree. I love trees. So now five decorate still uh decorate. Let's just just decorate. Six. Um, what else? What else am I trying to get get in here? Um, let's keep going with the, the the bees. You know, bees. Bees. I like those bees. They're they're a lot of fun. The bee lies and all that stuff's really really fun. Oh, magma. No, I have a magma crucible. Uh, therm thermal expand. And for now, let's let's leave it at that. Decorate bees, bees, more bees. Thermal X X E X P A expansion. And it's hard to spell a word when you don't see the other part of it. Done. High punch wooders. Boom. There we go. Thermal expand. Expansion. Bees, bees, more bees. Speaking of bees, let's check on my bees. I don't know if you guys actually saw this. <gasps> no, he got out or he died. Oh, that sucks. The sheep guy I brought in here and he's gone now. I'm going to go. You know, I'll, I'll do that. This episode also, I'll go check on um, those guys. See how they're doing. See if they're still kicking. I got a couple of emeralds out of them, so that's okay. So let's check on the bees, because I'm sure that this episode has not been close to what it was. There's nothing in that one. Oh, because I, I took them down because they were all bugged out. <laughs> Get it? Bugged out. So, stringy comb. So, we have a cultivated princess. Cultivated. Common. I'm going to have to start over on my bees. Cause my bees aren't producing the right hybrids. I had all, I had like two nobles and all that stuff, and I'm not getting anything right now. Oh, see, oh, 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 actually, uh, so this princess actually might be because she's producing those ones. Uh, maybe I should be using my bealizer instead of just kind of putting stuff in there, huh? There's a bunch of those. I think. Oh, I do. Uh, steadfast, Valiant, Majestic, Common. Oh, I do have a Majestic. I have two Majestics. But that needs a Noble. I need a Noble to breed with a Majestic. I don't want to breed a Majestic with a Cultivated. Ba 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 ba. Okay. She needs a Cultivated. She needs a common. She's doing her thing. She's doing her thing. And she needs a common. Boop. There we go. Now we're beating it up. This is my bag of crap bees that I don't want. They're not doing me any justice. So they are garbage bees. Let's check out down here. I tried to, I tried to do some of this tree hybrid stuff. And I don't know why it's not working. I'm pretty sure it's in this mod pack, but it might not be. And I need to check. Because as far as I can tell, these things are touching, but they're not doing anything. That might not be in my mod pack, because they're not doing diddly diddly. Unless these aren't the right bees for it, which I'll, I'll look up, because that might be the case. 
that she didn't produce seven. I just haven't checked these in a while. Or, I haven't been taking the combs out. Please don't get poisoned. Don't poison me. She's cooking. She's gonna cook. Oh, there we go. I'm poisoned. I'm poisoned. I'm poisoned. I'm poisoned. No. Oh, crud. Oh. I need to eat. Do I have food on me? Here we go, guys. I'm about to die. Oh, I forgot. Oh, I do have a... No, no, I don't want that stuff. Because it's just going to fly away when I die right now. No. Let's take that out. Uh, oh, I wanted an appetite filler, too. Oh. Oh, I didn't die. Oh, cr I didn't die. I don't know how I didn't die, but I didn't die. I maybe you can't die from that poison. Here. I need some beef. So, mode switch, mining, low focus, long range, horizontal, super heat, scatter, explosive. Long range, I think, is the one that does the most damage. Could be wrong. Boom! The Cow Killer mm. 5000. Mm. Okay. Well, mm. let me mm. cut out, and I'm gonna, let's go check on those guys right there, and I'll call that an episode. Oh, actually, you know what? First, let's do this. Where's my portal gun? Now that I have... I forgot I, I, I actually took all this stuff out, and I didn't remember that I put it in this bag... Because I was like, oh, there's no way I'll forget that they're in there. Yeah, I forgot they were in there. So, let's apply the filters. Okay. So, we want emeralds and diamonds to go in that way. You can die, because we don't like you. That's not nice. We shouldn't say that. And that could go in there, too and that one. Boom! Look at that. Appetite! Look at all this dirt. Uh, what's that? That's coal. Yeah, let's put the appetite and the coal together. There we go. Cool beans. I just gotta remember that I have a diamond out here. I'll sort through all this stuff later. Ruby, don't want that, 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 don't need that, don't need that. I think all my other stuff is in my chest, because I, or my, this thing, because I wasn't trying to die. I was, I, I, I don't know if I put that on there, uh, I've seen this, but I enchanted a diamond sword after my Glidia kill, and that's what I got. I made a diamond sword, because like, I want a good, a good long lasting sword, I'm going to put 30 levels on it. And I made a bunch of these swords, and I put, uh, like, 11 or 11 to 14 levels on. Let's bring him out. Actually, no. I have I have this gun. I'll use the gun. Portal gun I want right now. Where's that drill? I have a drill somewhere. Is it? I was using it. I wonder if it's in the mining bag. Hmm. Oh well, we'll find it. For now, I'm going to put a portal up, and I will see you guys when I get to the YouTube channel. Alright, we are approaching very cautiously. Now, this town should be pretty dried up, except for our survival, survival shelter. Yes, this is empty. I remodeled this tower, and nope, zombie villager is not in there anymore. But I put a zombie villager in there. Oop. Judging from the sounds that they're making, it looks like they're still alive. They are. Got chicken. The wheat guy, who I'm not going to trade with anymore because that's a really bad trade. I just grabbed him for fun time.
he was just a cool little extra. And let's see, he's he still wants to give me those apiaries, so I still might have to take them. And this is uh, this is buckets is gone, so this is gonna be Gus the chicken. Look, oh, there's the top of my hat. Look at that. <laughs> All right, guys. So we did it. We survived another one. Made it. Finally made the quarry. Um, let's go. Actually, let's go take a look at it real quick before I call it. Let's take a look how she, how she's going. And I might just AFK and let this baby run. Still on sand and dirt. Let's fly over here. Okay. We've got some ore right here. Let's do a little focus. A little focus will just give us the the one. Ooh, is this gonna hit the No, it's just gonna miss the water right there, good. So as you can see, oh, I must have blown that up. Oops. So as you can see, it is running swimmingly. And I'm going to take it off the mining laser, come to blow up. And this thing is full. That guy's full. These guys are going. There's no way to check how much juice is in that. Haven't found any cool stuff over here yet. He's obviously chugging away, which is good. If, if this machine is able to keep up up there with that thing, that's beautiful. Um... Let's take a couple of dirt and throw it. Oh, let's throw some dirt in there so they can chug a chug of that stuff out. Um, we got some copper, some sandstone, some sand. My, it looks like it took out some torches as well. Nothing in there yet, and nothing in there yet. But we're still at the top, like two layers. You know, this is level seventy. It'll take some stuff, and I'll, I'll periodically throughout the series, uh, as I'm recording, this will get deeper, and, and we'll show you show you the progress of that. So, I got something planned special for next time. I'm approaching a thousand views, so hopefully by the time that goes up, maybe I'll either I'll make that the a uh, thousand thousand view special, um, where it'll probably be a little bit shorter, but there'll be some cool stuff in there. So. Stay tuned, and remember to keep on Minecrafting. Minecraft, see you next time. Thanks for the view. Sigma, like and subscribe. Sigviver, Sigvival, Sigscriber, all day. Minecraft, need to be, need to be, need to be.